Hello friends! Today I'm going to the craft show and I'm going to take you with me so we can see what we can find. Let's go! Look at that beautiful, with all the sparkly lights and all her beautiful towels she made. Oh, these are the scarves, kitchen scarves that go around your neck. Right. Sh show me what else you have. I've got the little gift bags or little purses for little kids. Oh, how cute! It's like a and little Santa's. What? And then it's like a little purse. How cute is that? Oh, yeah, Adorable. Gift a gift bag or a little purse. And we have the card holders. How cute. I love that. Love the fabric. I love that little truck with my colors. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right there. So cute. Look at that. She turned, is that a, a wine bottle or an olive oil bottle? It's a wine bottle. A wine bottle. Look at that with the beautiful cardinals. So pretty. And my lanterns. Beautiful. It can be a lantern or it can be a candy dish. Mm -hmm. Look at, huh? show me what's... These are our ugly little men that I call them, but they're really gnomes, but I call them the ugly little men. <laughs> Those are cute. Alex got men all over it. Bowl cozies, those are cute. Mm -hmm. Good idea. Our keychain tree. Oh, how cute. These are your cutting boards. Cutting boards. That you put fabric on the back. Mm -hmm. How pretty. Did you mod podge? They're nice for a... Yes. Oh, look. These are the little ones you the... use for when you're in the kitchen. You always got a towel in your hand. Yes. Beautiful kitchen scarf. And did you put mod podge on the back of these? Right. Yes. With fabric. Beautiful. Look at all the designs. Beautiful cutting boards. Even ones with sports teams on them. Yes. My husband would say, go Gators. <laughs> and look at all these towels. And look at their bag holders. It's a little bear with overalls and you put your little bags in there to store. Isn't that cute? Look at the bib. Beautiful. This one. Loads of love. We're Hi. over here. Hi, Debbie. Hi. Show us what you've made. Well, I have these wallets that I make. Um, they really hold a lot of stuff. Wow. A lot of pockets. I love that. A lot that. of pockets, a lot of card holders. Your phone goes in there. Wow. Some of them I have matching bags and wallets. You made all these? Yes. Wow. Beautiful. Show us the bag. And the bag's fantastic. <laughs> yeah, they're just, you know, little closures on them. Um, I have the stuff full, but it's got pockets inside too. How cute. I love the fabric. Is that like a vinyl? Yeah, some vinyl, and... some leather, some, yeah, just anything I, anything I got. Beautiful. And these are just fabric baskets here. You can use them for putting candy in, um, cookies, anything you want to. Good idea. Candy cane holders, oh, nice huh. little gifts. You made that out of, yep. out of embroidery? Out of, yep. Your embroidery machine? My embroidery machine, wow. yep. They all have the holes in them to put the candy canes through. Some ornaments and, you know, the year we couldn't afford gas. Oh, that's funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got some uh, runners. And these are just some fabric bowls. So they can lay flat when you're storing them. Uh -huh. And then the edges, they just Velcro together. Oh, how cute. To make a bowl. Cute. And then we have car trash bags. Oh, you always need that. That's a car trash bag? Yep. 
helps oh, around your headrest. Oh, yeah. fits around the headrest? Yeah. In the back seat? In the, and so you have yeah. a, oh, so you that's just, yeah. great idea. Yeah. And that's pretty much what I've been doing. Well, thank you, Debbie, for sharing. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. Um, well, this is all made by the um, Hawthorne Lapidary Club. Okay. And um, what are these? Those are, those those are purse hangers. Purse hangers. Oh. Limited edition. <laughs> oh, to hang your purse on the table. She's yes. This one here is um, an opal. It's raw. It's you can see it inside uh -huh. the stone. Wow! And that's what we we take is we take the stone and find the best part of it. And opals are really soft.
look at these little change purses <laughs> in the shape of a cupcake. How adorable.
I've been doing stained glass for almost 30 years, wow. Te teaching lots and lots of students. Wow. I enjoy this more than anything. I've restored windows in my church in Maine, and uh, I just really have a passion for stained glass. Beautiful. Thank you.
these are one, two, three. Yeah, four cider. Okay. <laughs> Not hard. They do take a lot of, lot of time, and you gotta do them together the right way.
that's been repaired I'm, I'm in the Japanese style of Ikibara. No, no. What happens is... Ikibara. Uh, Ikibari. Right here is it. And this has got some paper and glue on a basket that's been... That had a problem. And now it's light and strong. It can be used for anything. You just wipe it right out. And not dishwasher safe, but everything else is fine about it. These are Coptic books. This was a um, style that the early Christians used to bind their papyrus. So it's sewn binding. And then the signatures have covers and the book lays flat if you want to write in it or draw in it or anything in it. Um, the papers have been marbled and I have a little em embellishment here that's enamel. So that would be glass on copper. Um, and then, let's see, these little boxes, I like this one. This is marbled paper, and then I've just covered the inside and outside of the box. It's good for a treasure. Cute. Or paper clips, whatever's, whatever you got.
sell the crafts, which I've been doing for years and years. They're beautiful. And my special love is Cali cross stitch. Wow. That's beautiful. I stitched it and my husband framed it. Wow. Teamwork. Yes.
Thanks for coming along to the craft show with me today. Hope y'all had fun. Have a so blessed day. Bye for now.